hey guys welcome to twins editing and today we are going to make a grunge effect in adobe illustrator and we are going to make the grunge texture by ourselves from an image so let's get started it will be a very fast and quick tutorial Bring the madness. To make the grunge effect first I'm going to copy the flat design into another one so we can use the grunge or dart effect on this one opening the file in illustrator you can see it's a complete flat design no grunge or dart effect so uh, to uh, apply the grunge effect I'm going to group all the layers and Now we are going to open the transparency tab, select the group and you can see there is an option to make mask. So we are going to add the grunge effect on this black uh, rectangular uh, option you can see. So first we are going to make the grunge effect from the image. I have already downloaded this uh, wall background. I have given the link in the description. You can use your own uh, image from any source. So click on the image trace and press OK. Go to the window and image trace option and you can see some more additional uh, options here. I'm going to play with the threshold to see how it comes if I increase it a little. Um, this is too much for me. I'm going to reduce a, lo a little. So basically this is up to you, you can uh, play with this one, the grunge effect you will see, um, I'm now using the magic wand to delete the white part, so only the black part will stay. Now you can select your uh, whole layout and place it on the rectangular size dashboard so basically this will be used as the grunge effect so you can create your own grunge effect from the images this is very easy I'm saving it as texture vector file so we can use it for later now I'm going to copy this and paste here That's it. <laughs> Placing the image as I want it. Now you can see that the grunge effect is already uh, there and if I open the layer option you can see it's already working and it's it, it it will be working in any background you can change the background color if you want to so yes basically this is how you can create your own very own custom grunge effect from any kind of uh, images so thanks for watching the video see you in the next one